My name is Alexandra Peter. Oh, do you want me to say more things? Um, did you say my last name? Is that weird? I'm Alexandra Peter. I am a dancer and a yogi and a yoga teacher. And I am an aerialist and just a lover of movement. Yoga's given me the, the opportunity to see something that's much bigger than myself. To get out of my own head, to get out of my own suffering to choose what I get to do with this life and this body that I have. I'm still working on figuring out how to really live that every day, but it is, it is something that I know, that I didn't know before. I practice yoga every day, not yoga on my mat, but in my life. So when my husband, who's white, and I are walking down the street and someone will make a comment or give me a look, I am now able to recognize it and instead of internalizing it and bringing the trauma into my own body, I can say, like, that's about you. Like, that's about them, that is not about me. Whatever reaction someone else is having to you, is because of their own insecurity, their own struggle with their own identity. It's hard to do that in the moment, but yoga has given me so many more tools to be able to, if not do it right then and there, at least do it later that later in that night. And I've been very fortunate to have an amazing husband who helps me recognize those things. Gives me, you know, we talk about it all the time. We're constantly talking about race, our relationship, my parents. The discussions are what keeps me coming back to the mix space after two and a half years. The community. I want to hear about other people's experiences. And it validates me just in listening, just in being there. I don't have to talk at all or uh, be heard at all, but just to hear someone else's experience in a completely different part of the world with completely different parents, completely different mix is validating for me. We are all the same. We've all gone through the same thing. I can relate to every single person there. To be other is not so bad anymore.